Stacks can be susceptible to vortex shedding, which can cause large amplitude vibration. A damping pad is one option that can be used to reduce this undesirable vibration. This is a damping pad. It is placed under the stack faceplate and is usually one inch or 25 millimeters thick. Under the damping pad is a steel leveling plate. A damping washer, also usually one inch or 25 millimeters thick, is placed between a steel washer and the top plate of the base plate. A steel washer is placed above the damping washer. As the stack vibrates, the pad deforms. Here the deformation is greatly exaggerated so that it is visible to the eye. This small amount of deformation serves to increase the structural damping of the stack and suppress the vibration. Damping pads have several advantages. They do not increase the wind loads on the structure. They are impervious to most oils and solvents. And since they are not frequency dependent, they will work for all modes of vibration. A damping pad has several disadvantages as well. It can only endure temperatures up to 200 degrees Fahrenheit or 93 degrees Celsius. It is difficult to use a damping pad to retrofit an existing stack because it is placed underneath the stack. It also adds a slight increase in the lateral deflection of the stack, and it does not provide enough damping for every stack. The MechaStack software will not design the damping pad. However, the software will allow the damping pad to be considered as part of the stack analysis. If you think a damping pad is needed, then send Mecha your MechaStack input file. With this file, we can then evaluate the damping pad and estimate the structural damping provided by the pad. Mecha will then return the Mecha stack file with the appropriate damping pad parameters as well as the estimated damping for each mode. When Mecha supplies a damping pad, we supply the pad in segments.